High School Football in St. Johns County, and we are down to the final eight teams left in the state. I'm Justin Barney, sports editor at the St. Augustine Record, and we're here to talk about St. Augustine High School. They are the only team left standing in North Florida in Class 3A, and the Yellow Jackets are here tonight against Pensacola, courtesy of a 43-23 win over Clay last weekend. Uh, the Yellow Jackets just in control from the start on that one, and uh, really not even the threat that uh, Clay was supposed to be. They just could not stop St. Augustine on defense. That brings us to an entirely different beast uh, for the Yellow Jackets. As a team, St. Augustine knows well. They played Pensacola last year at this stage in the regional finals, and St. Augustine took a 9-0 loss from that game. It was the first shutout in nine years uh, that St. Augustine has endured. And much of the same tonight. These two teams unbeaten, both teams 12-0, and uh, strong defenses on both sides of the ball. Pensacola giving up teams just 5.1 points a game, uh, just a, a monster on the defensive side of the ball, the Tigers are. They won the, the uh, Class 3A state championship last season. They're in the midst of a 26-game winning streak, uh, second longest in the state behind Coco. And uh, St. Augustine really a, a mirror of the Tigers on the defensive side of the ball. St. Augustine anchored by Tara Godon, big defensive lineman, and just a ball-hawking, swarming defense, linebackers James Rents and Will Masters. Uh, and stacks up very, very well against Pensacola. So it should be a very low-scoring, very defensive-themed game tonight. Probably a field goal is going to decide this game. Uh, last year, 9-0, 3-0 uh, until the fourth quarter. So expect a very similar game tonight. A win tonight, St. Augustine. They would go on the road next week, uh, probably down to play either Tampa Jefferson. Uh, that's the number one team in the state, Jefferson, playing uh, tonight. So... No telling what's going to happen, but St. Augustine last home game, win or lose tonight at Bromley Stadium. And hopefully we'll be talking to you next week about a state semifinal matchup uh, with your St. Augustine Yellow Jackets.